Hey there, geeks. Tim with MajorGeeks.com. Today we're going to show you how to show more details in the File Explorer Transfer Dialog by default. As you know, just so we can clarify what we're doing here, let's move a folder. And we'll copy it here. And then the dialog comes up. It looks like this. This is your default. But it, you can click more details. And then you get all this extra information in here, which is nice. So what we want to do is we want to make that default. In other words, you're not going to have to continuously click every single time you look at it. So let's do it. You can do it with our registry files first. So just find this link with the information, a little I button up here in the video description. Follow this through. Click download now. It should come right on your computer instantly, as you can see. And let's open it up. And there's a link to the tutorial, as always, right here if you need to jump to here. And the video will be embedded here when I'm done recording. And let's do show more details. Show fewer is your default. Let's double click that. Click run. Click yes. Click yes again. And then we click OK. You should consider backing up your registry as well. There is a link here if you want. Back up your registry with instructions on how to back it up and restore it. All right, so now that we've got it done, you saw what happened with the fewer details. Let's go back and try it now. Copy it over here. And as you can see, we now have the large dialog window, and you'll get it every single time. Change your mind. Show fewer details. Same thing. Run. Yes. Yes. Okay. And real quick. As you can see, now when we do this again, it will be the fewer. More details and fewer details, the default. Now, for the geeky of you, you might want to edit your registry. Not too tough to do either. You can do it yourself. We're going to copy this key right here. Start the registry editor, Windows key plus R. And do Reddit, reg edit. Let's see. Or you can right click and do run any way you want to do it. I do that out of habit a lot. Click OK. And copy and paste that in here. Press Enter. There we go. There's the enthusiast mode. That is the key you're going to want to create. So I'll show you by deleting it. Once you use our registry files, it's going to just set the D word to 0 or 1. So now that you know it's called enthusiast mode, we are going to right click on this side of the address I told you to go to. So you're the operation status manager key. We're going to right click. We're going to do new D word 32 bit value. And we're going to copy and paste or type in enthusiast mode. Now that it's done, all you have to do is change it from one to show more details. So we'll double click that. Press one, press OK. You can see it right there. So now when I go to copy, it'll automatically show more details. If you want to turn it on or off, change it back to a zero to go back to the fewer details. Or if you have no interest in it anymore, click delete. And you can delete the enthusiast mode key. And there you have it. It's just kind of a neat way to have more details. As you know, sometimes when stuff's copying, it can be kind of quick. It gives you the option to see everything in a shorter amount of time without having to click anything. I like it. It's a neat little undocumented little tweak there. And it's part of Major Geek's Windows tweaks, which you can find right here. And there you have it. Bottom right-hand corner. Click subscribe. Thanks for watching as always. See ya.